Are you serious? Are you seriously serious? Well, if you was um, uh, uh, present with us when we did the live New Year's Eve broadcast, you know it was a very powerful broadcast. Seriously. Uh, Heidi had done some great research. We took, we reviewed the 14 apocalyptic signs for the year 2014. We went down all 14 of them. The, the, and it was unreal how all 14 of them came to pass. And matter of fact, exceeded any expectation on all of them. It was just unbelievable when you started to look at the links and started to look at the uh, actual factual things that took place. It's quite amazing how Bible prophecy is coming to pass and, uh, and happening so rapidly now, so quickly now. It's not, let's wait and see what God's going to do. It's what has he done today and how much has he done every hour. So we reviewed that. I'll put the link of that broadcast. You can watch the entire uh, new live stream archive of it. I'll put the link to that, my new live stream channel on this video. But besides reviewing the 14 apocalyptic signs for 2014, we also revealed the prophetic look, the 15 points of the prophetic look at the year 2015. What is the prophetic look? And um, wow, uh, we also went through those in the broadcast. I would like to give you a quick, short uh, version of the prophetic look for 2015. Number one, there will be a mighty shaking on the earth, in the heavens, and spiritually in the church. This is going to be supported by Hebrews chapter 26, excuse me, Hebrews chapter 12, verse 26, and Luke's gospel chapter 21 Verses 25 and 26. Here's what Luke says. And there shall be signs in the sun and in the moon and in the stars and upon the earth distress of nations with perplexity, the sea and the waves roaring, men's hearts failing them for fear, for looking after those things which are coming on the earth for the powers of heaven shall be shaken. All right, uh, that is a word that the Lord gave us uh, for this coming year of 2015. Now, there's another word that was confirmed by uh, a man on YouTube by the name of Shannon Johnson, who also was uh, been praying and God gave him a word. He turned on his uh, YouTube camera and got ready to start to read it when an earthquake hit right where he was at there. Uh, just north of San Diego, California. And uh, he received, it, it shook the camera, it shook the Da Vinci painting behind him of the Last Supper. It, it, you literally could hear it. And then he read this scripture. And it says in Hebrews chapter 12, verse 26, whose voice then shook the earth, but now he hath promised, saying, yet once more, I shake not the earth only, but also heaven. And it was a direct confirm, confirmation of um, what the Lord had laid on our heart for this year, 2015. That's point number one. Mighty shaking on the earth and the heavens and spiritually in the church. Number two, the Hosea prophecy will increase in the year 2015. And 15. Number three, world leader will die changing things politically somewhere in the world. Now, I know that just, just so, and I, we did this Christmas, or excuse me, excuse me, New Year's Eve, and I just heard that uh, former Governor Mario Como just died. Um, and uh, just, but uh, we'll, we'll wait and see what specifically else. Uh, who else, maybe, that will literally impact the world? Number four, Russia will fight back the sanctions. And what I didn't know, and I did uh, with the very next day, January 1st, Vladimir Putin gave a New Year address in which he told the Russian people, prepare to defend yourself 
against those that are putting sanctions upon Mother Russia. Prepare to defend the motherland. Uh, let's see what this might mean. Now, number five, ISIS will grow stronger. They will not grow weaker. Even though the United States and a coalition of Arabic nations are bombing them, they won't get weaker. They will be stronger in the year 2015. Number six, Pope Francis will shock the world. I don't know what that means. Will he say something that's shocking? Will he do something that's shocking? Uh, will something happen to him that's shocking? I don't know what this means. But again, number seven, revival, major revival will break out. Major revival will break out. Oh, praise God for that. Amen. Number eight, Christian persecution will be as bad or worse than it was last year. Uh, of course, the, you know, there is Bible prophecy, of course, confirming that. Number nine, Illuminati. The Illuminati will become bolder. The Illuminati will become bolder. Now, I don't know if that's in the Hollywood industry, music industry, entertainment industry. Is it going to be actual Bilderberg proclamations? I don't know. But the Illuminati, will it be politicians making speeches, just speaking more about the New World Order? The Illuminati will become bolder. Number 10, devastating earthquakes will take place in the year 2015. Number 11, financial distress, especially in the West. I'm not sure... How that works. Of course, there's a lot of nations involved in Western nations. Number 12, Israel will defend its border. And I, uh, what, does that mean they're attacked? Is there a war? Do they have to defend themselves big time in the United Nations? Uh, what does it mean? Number 13, more deadly diseases and plagues. Something I didn't want to see or hear. Number 14, extreme weather will intensify in this year, 2015. And number 15, blood moons, blood water, blood shed. Blood moons, blood water, blood shed. This is 15 points. This is a, a prophetic look at the year 2015. It is not a prophecy. It's not even a prediction. It is a prophetic look at where we're at right now and what's coming upon the earth. Give your life to Jesus Christ. No man knows the day nor the hour. No man knows the day nor the hour. Not even the angels in heaven. Not even the Son of God, but the Father only. Matthew 24, 36. Mark 13, 32. He's coming soon. Are you serious? Are you serious? Are you saved?